And, and when you think about the sacrifice that she was willing to make for her community and service of her community, uh, those are things that uh, are certainly what you're going to consider are going to be at the forefront of your mind. The Marion County prosecutor will seek the death penalty for Elias Dorsey, the man charged in the murder of IMPD officer Breanne Leith. Leith, as you remember, was killed in April of last year. CBS 4's Courtney Spinelli was in the courtroom today for that hearing. She joins us now with more. Over the last nine months, Marion County Prosecutor Ryan Mears says they've gathered evidence in the murder of Officer Breanne Leith. After discussions, including some with Leith's family, they're now seeking the death penalty. Leith's mother says she just wants justice. Police officer or not, she was more than a police officer. She was my baby. She was a mom to a baby. For the first time since IMPD Officer Breanne Leith was killed while responding to a disturbance. Her parents sat in a courtroom with the man accused of taking her life. But I feel like I had to be here to represent Bree, to be there, and I hope he saw us. Prosecutors said today they are seeking the death penalty for Elias Dorsey, who is charged with Officer Leith's murder. You certainly want to be deliberate in, in the process and try to consider as much in, in all information as possible. Marion know, County know. Prosecutor Ryan Mears says the time frame for resolving a case like this increases. Rather than months, it could be years. They also have to discuss any factors that could be the reason Dorsey should not face the death penalty if convicted. We want to make sure that you are fairly and completely evaluating all of that information. Looking backwards in terms of you go into the person's background, you look at their mental health history, their educational experiences, their criminal histories, all of those types of things. As the case proceeds, Mears wants people to focus on honoring Officer Leith, what she stood for, and what the community and her family lost. I think too often times there's too much emphasis placed on the defendant. She just loved life. She was so full of it. Leith's family says they'll be at every court appearance until justice is served and say they pray for the family of the man sitting on the other side of the courtroom. My husband and I loved our child, but his family lost his son too, basically. A pretrial conference has now been set for April 20th. However, Mears says with this new filing, the judicial process in this case will slow down significantly. Reporting downtown, Courtney Spinelli, CBS 4 News. And today, IMPD released a statement following the announcement saying, Today's announcement is an opportunity to reflect on all that Officer Breanne Leith gave to her community in her all too short time with us. It goes on to say Officer Breanne Leith will always represent the spirit of IMPD and will always be remembered.